The BBC had studios in New York and two London locations to cover the 2016 US elections. Idonix provided the data and user interfaces to get the graphics on air, on time, on election night. Once votes are cast, popular vote data is received from Associated Press. State calls, which drive the Electoral College vote and thus the overall election result, are input directly into the Ignition interface. Idonix aggregate and sort the data and then send to both BBC Digital for online services and of course to the main election programme graphics. Idonix provided 10 Ignition servers with replicated feeds, some hosted in the cloud and others on site. A web-based inquiry page allowed editorial to see and search results and state calls as they come in. In the studio, BBC staff search, choose and output graphics using bespoke interfaces for lower thirds, full forms, touchscreen and Jeremy Vine's virtual set. There's also an automated system to drive results instantly to Twitter in English and Spanish direct from the studio floor. Idonix took BBC designs and implemented the user interfaces and data integration for the touchscreen in New York. The producer can stack a series of graphics with the presenter and rehearse off-screen before going live. Once again, Idonix deliver data, workflow and real-time graphics to create a successful show for a high-profile broadcast event.